from the YouTube headquarters. This is Earn Night Night with El Mule. And now, everybody buckle up and put your helmets on. Because this guy is going to take you on the ride. And it's going to be bumpier than all the rest. But there's going to be some smooth spots. Mr. Ram, yeah. Oh. Welcome. Welcome to any, Welcome to Night Night with El Mule. And folks. And folks, be very prepared for a bumpy ride because... This so uh, we have we have the turbulence to have to get some smooth smooth bumps up there as we drive as we fall to it uh, to a to to a to a to a recovery of the new era. Oh, the real train of the new uh, accusations on TNA Impact Wrestling is who is the next main star. What Moose was Mike Bennett's personal crush on 2016 or was it 2015? You know, you know, you know I got my head on it. Uh, uh, he won this this is an X due to Dixie Man and Papa Glory, but and Papa Glory Glory and ex and ex and exact the point here is that that might that might my bag will be fired. But then again, this is what my Greg was had the WWE, and he was and he was being met with these. Three the longer Maria did the brother catch. He over he overpowered the superstar. Mike made the ultimate star also the you know the act. You should have smart you up, you dumb fucking moron. Bessie, Bessie, you're going down on Southversary. I told you, no folks could never see, could never say this before. I, but not things never happen. One strange is mid-match, Eddie Edwards tangle with Moose, two brown for glory, and homecoming. That falls out anywhere, Max. That, that was we rude. That was we rude. That was involved. And he's white, Alicia. And of course, that was turning Raven. However, uh, ah, okay. Now, yeah, we, we hope that that's what that that one story ever. Confess it, news losing the NCAA World Auto in the mass this weekend. Weekend, I prep. You know what? He will prep. He will, that was mine. Hey, look, sir, quick, you're going to be the end of it for the building. Came in uh, through the helicopter. Let's see what they got to say. Well, well, folks, I mean, well, folks, the Oscar was so nice. Great, nice entire year. Yeah, I don't want to outsaw a tide here. That it will start will bring my flowers. But the day I turn time that that means that we are finally spring over. Spring forward, B they turn. Yeah, Jericho, I knew about it. Well anyway, Moose is continuing his path to become teenage well and I separate him by what cost? Yeah, the cost is this. Hello, Kerry Omega won the, won the, won, won the AEW well, well tile from, from Don Moxley. That's right. Don Moxley is on both shows with Don Cardis from the back wrestling in all his wrestling. Huh. You might have the WWE, it's going to fight, 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 the guy. In the back, clearly, the right side the right tire. Or the new Dory Sarge, and now, the Almighty Barry Lashley. Okay, so Moose might be not the greatest mind of all time. But don't take it like me here. We are in the most important match in Moose's career. <laughs> yeah, against Quick Squad, another, another black guy who, who be a black. That's my mother, we, we, we. You gotta say this one thing, Jericho. I know, B.J. Penn. 
Where else do we have to go? It should, it should be the king, and we're so good to be, to be someone else. Yeah, Jericho, yeah, we've already knew about it. Hooray! I knew I was going to say it here, but no, boots. You stoop, you stupid idiot. You know what happened? We're trying to make fun of why two seven feet in ten. You know what happened? When you don't stare your labels? You know what happened? Yeah! What are you gonna do, Zach? What are you gonna do? I don't know what I'm gonna do right now, Moose. But for your crazy ass hicks, you're not gonna do this! Yay! Uh, Zach Ho, Moose didn't have to be on the list. Well, that's wrestling on the list here. But that, but that mess hot, Moose. For Canada, he stays wherever he is. That's pro. That's what I call. That's pro. That's how we do it. Ah, post Coco Pebble cereal in paradise. Part of a good breakfast. <laughs> yeah, it's King Coco. Mmm, chocolatey. Me want Coco Pebble. Uh -oh. Kids, help! He took my Cocoa Pebbles! And Bonnie! Somebody's behind this, but who? You can use the clues and a post token from Mark Boxes to log on to Postopia. Solve the mystery and unlock the secret cartoon revealing who's behind King Coco! Moose gets, moose gets revenge by defeating Mike, Mike Bennett. 
on the Cheerio Workers Camp, the theme of Australia, working forces with Keller for Keller Quah, turned his back on Aaron Edwards, and held the Cheerio World title in the town. And now he announced, and, and now he called called Rick Swan, another total, total cow of being here as well, that man. I hate to say this, folks, here, but I think we need, we need, we need, we need some full underhandings here. Why most will go after the, the age, you know, the early wrestling captain, Kenny Omega, right before he, he beat a Rick Swan at Sacrifice. We got Bob, come up, so Bob here to answer the whole question. Bob, what is, what is your answer? Well, kind of the point here, thank you. My fear is that Moose will get, will get up, try to hit, try to hit, put Swan with a spear, and then get hit by wind pole. The other Swan would then later hit his own busy move, use the key leg, what that, as a weapon, knock them out, and pin them. So which Swan will become the TNA World Heavyweight now. Now, but I do know that fact that Moose will will do something to put the put 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 one in the prison hole. Would make put one instantly tapped out beneath. Which Swan always had up before, but we can just tap out the his last. Well, I don't know, cowboy boy, I know. I think this news is that at least we all know what's going on here. Uh, uh, thanks, Bob. But I don't think the news that takes a lot more time here to say that Moose and Wick Swan, TLA World, West Matt, we have a, an unclear cut winner. Despite Scott Demore's answers. Well, kind of the point here. Rick Swan has been in, has has been coming around his since 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 he sent one of the questions, and now he's back in the ring doing one of the things he always does here because he's not because Rick Swan not retiring, but Moose, oh Moose, if you think you're going think you're going to be the biggest star on Impact. He'll be the real one gap. Pretty soon, Dunnery will fight. Get this look on you. And pretty soon, Moose will be one superstar hanging at top. From Impact to Dunnery, the regular system. And pretty soon, this whole virus will eradicate your bad behavior. Oh, yeah! Like I someone say, if you, if you, if you, if you don't say it, you are doomed to repeat it. Oh, I don't say we don't need to repeat that word. Well, kind of the point here, it's not like you're trying to get your hopes up here. That's what, that's what drives, drives, drives these cats wild. Oh, Harley! What I said there was the truth. Watch out for the spinning elephants! What? You guys are right to uh, avoid getting hit by the spinning elephants! You guys are right now! Oh. Spinning elephants! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, folks. So I kind of wanted to spin every detail here. But Moose! It's completely gone a bit crazy. Well then, I think we the, the other show we got for tonight. For tomorrow night, we'll find more we'll talk about eating Eastwood's move, movies, movie in 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 in, in, in a duck duck and stuff, and this new movie that might come out here in 2022. Even more and more 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 fans will see this movie. Except. Because on Thursday and Friday it's Hawk Souls again and 
I don't know what that is, folks, yeah, but then this week so we're getting more and more excellent by the time goes goes moving near to the heart. That's the news and I am out of here. That's the pizza, baby.